Okay, so today I'm going to make a chuck roast in the Instant Pot. And this is three pounds of chuck roast. This has to cook a very long time because it doesn't have a lot of marbling in it. And it's a really tough piece of meat. So you can use this in the slow cooker that will cook about six to eight hours. And I'm going to cook this for about an hour in the pressure cooker. So I'm going to start off by pressing the saute and I'm going to let the inside get hot and then I'm going to saute it on both sides like make it brown. Okay so what I'm going to do is season it on both sides with some garlic, some salt, smoked paprika and pepper. Leave a comment if you guys go to Costco for this. I got to get some more. I'm almost empty. I need both my hands and I'm holding the camera to do this. So I'll be right back. Okay, let that cook on both sides. We'll start off on that one, the, the side it's on now, for a couple of minutes, and then I'm gonna turn it over. And then I'm gonna add some cut onions. I don't have beef stock, so I'm gonna use some of this, chicken stock. I don't know if that's gonna make a difference in the taste, but that's what I'm gonna use. At the bottom of the pot, that's what I'm going to be using. About this much at the bottom. Okay, so I got some of this chicken stock, like I said. I'm going to put it in the bottom. Not a lot, but just at the bottom, about... About this much and then I'm gonna add two onions now that I got the onions in there I'm going to put the lid on put this all the way over there for the pressure to build up and I'm going to manually put it for an hour There you go, one hour. So once this pressure starts to build up, then it's gonna cook for one hour. We'll be back. Okay, there you go. Now the pressure's gotta build up. And then it'll start cooking for one hour. So it's been an hour and four minutes here. It's been sitting here. The pressure is still built up in here. And it will take some time to go down. But what you can do is you can slowly release the pressure like this. Or you can let it decrease by itself. Okay, so it took about six minutes for the pressure to go down. Like really tender, really tender. I'm gonna take it and put it in this plate right here.
was falling apart. Grab that piece right there. Okay. Right. Yeah, it's falling apart. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Mm. Look at that. All right, guys. So let me know if you guys have one of these um, pressure cookers. Only took one hour to cook. Nice and tender, falling apart. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next video.